Hey everybody! All right, our objective in math today is to use dot paper, graph paper, to carefully copy figures. Both are about the same as far as utility, but maybe you use them slightly differently. So let's take a look at both of these um, math tools and see what's going on. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna let you in on as far as um, this activity goes is you have to be very careful. Um, we're not just drawing an L. So if someone said copy this figure, they don't want you to just come close. They want you to count and be precise. That's why they've given you dot paper. All right? So you're not just going to kind of say, well, there's my triangle. It's the same as this triangle. Well, is it? Right? You want to make it look like a copy machine. So let's do one. Here's my dot paper. The dot paper helps me make the sides exactly straight and exactly the right size. So I'm going to go ahead and just pull this out a little bit so I can use it as a reference. I'm going to be making this red L. And it starts off really easy across the top with one space. So I'm just going to find one space that I like. And done. Okay, so now I come down two spaces. One, two. So I'm going to start right at that corner. And I'm going to come down one. Two, stop. Now I go over one. So I'm gonna go over one, stop, down, check. Over two, okay, so one, two, and then the back is just straight up and down. One, two, three. I copied this shape exactly. It's the same size, it's the same shape, it takes up the same area, which is an idea that you'll get to in math a little bit later. Now, not all of them are going to be as easy as this one. This one had every line on every dot. Some of these, you're going to have to go in between the dots when you're connecting, and those are not as easy. Let's do one more where all the lines are on dots. We're going to start with this triangle here. I need a lot of space for this one. I need one, two, three, four spaces. So I'm going to go one, two, three, four. So I've done the top. Now I'm going to go down, touch a middle, down. Okay, so here I go. I'm going to come down, touch that middle dot, down, stop. Okay, then I'm going to come over to this side, down, touch the middle, down, stop. I have copied this shape exactly, right? I counted the dots, I counted the spaces, I counted down. Carefully drawing these figures is the goal of the day. Here we go. Now, oh, there we go. Let's put the dot paper away and see how graph paper works. Because to be honest, graph paper and dot paper are almost exactly the same. The only thing different is on graph paper, you have little squares instead of dots to kind of guide your drawing. So when you're doing this, you're going to do it the same way. You're going to look where you want to start. You're going to count one, two, three over, and then stop. Go down just the same way. So in your book, they're going to use these pages and the dot paper pages to have you carefully copy figures. It's as simple as that today. Let me show you the work you're going to do. All right, so we talked about, okay. So they're going to give you a figure on the left and some dot paper on the right. The first thing I would do if I were you is zoom in on my iPad as far as it'll let me. I think in Seesaw, I didn't put um, as many of these on one page. Let's start with the um, example up at the top since that'll leave you guys more to work on on your own. So I'm going to start right here. So I'm going to go down one, over one down one, over one, and I'm starting in the exact same spot. That's always a good good place to begin. Then I'm gonna go over one, two, with a line. One, two, stop right here. I'm gonna come down. One, two, three, stop right there. 
then I'm going to connect these and it does not touch that dot. Notice that. So that's a little bit tricky. You're going to try to go straight there. I want you to get your shapes looking exactly like the figure. Do not just get close. Triangle, huh? Or let's say, uh, let's just pretend I was drawing this one and I was like, doo, 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 doo. done. Mm -mm. The idea with math today is to copy each figure carefully. You're gonna have to count and plan using the paper. Second page is gonna be almost exactly like the first. Um, some of these are harder to see. It might make sense to trace them once and come up with a plan. Like if I was going to do this bow tie here, I would know I was going to start right here. I would go right there. So first part, then I come up to here. Second part, straight, straight down, straight, straight down. There you go. And then I believe on the next slide, I have a couple fun games for you. Thanks everybody. Bye now.